Assalamu alaikum. We were just discussing among friends today regarding uh, a news clip that came through uh, WhatsApp <clears throat> regarding a brother who does a lot of da'wah work and he visited South Africa and uh, during his last uh, speech of the, of the visit he showed disappointment in the South African people because he said that um, out of every out of the whole events that he had um, out of every four events out of every five events or something one was uh, to talk to give a million and the rest was all about eating and uh, he, f he said that he was uh, disappointed because he spent his time away from family he sacrificed to come and do dawa work and he doesn't feel that he uh, did justice to his trip um, I, I just want to point out a few things of my, of my opinion is that firstly every country has its own culture and we as South African we love to feed people in fact one of the ways to promote Islam is to actually promote Salam and to feed people because by feeding people, people don't actually fight when there's food in front of them, but they would listen to whatever the host is saying and the da'wah work will actually be quite beneficial. But at the same time also, if we are feeding someone, I mean imagine, we are inviting, we are honoring a guest by inviting him into our home. And we're not only having a one-to-one -one conversation with that person, we are inviting our whole family. In fact, our culture is to actually invite the, half the town to come over to, um, to our home to have a meal with us. It, it's an honor. It's really an honor. Um, and that's our culture. And Bri is definitely within our culture. We love Bri's. Nevertheless, um, what I would say is that when you visit other, when, when, when somebody visits another country you know the saying when in Rome do as the Romans do so in order for them to understand the message that you want to convey across you've got to enjoy and you've got to captivate as well as uh, embrace the culture and talk the language that they want to talk to you about so if uh, speak their language so that they can understand the message that you want to convey we don't really want to hear of the sacrifices you have made because it just takes the whole shine out of the dawa work that you're trying to do go to a country embrace the country embrace the people embrace the culture do your dawa work and go back home that is what I feel Dawah is about, inshallah. May Allah Ta'ala give us the opportunity to do Dawah work on neutral grounds and also embrace different cultures and make them understand what Islam is all about without complaining, inshallah. Islam alaikum.